This is question 6, paper 1 from the SQA specimen paper for National 5 Mathematics. We're given a scatter diagram and a line of best fit. And we're asked to find the equation of this straight line. Well, let's just do a little reminder of how we find equations of straight lines. There's two things we need to know uh, when we want to find the equation of a straight line. First of all, we need to know a gradient, and then we need to know a point on the line. And if we know these two things, then the equation of the line is y minus b equals m x minus a. So m's the gradient, a b is the point we know, y minus the y coordinate is the same as the gradient times x minus the x coordinate. So in this case, let's have a look at this point. That's the point 11, 23. And this point is the point 17, 35. So we certainly know a point on the line, we're spoiled for choice, we have two points, but we don't know the gradient. So if I call this point A and this point B, our first task is to find the gradient of that line AB. And this, for this we use the gradient formula, which is the y difference over the x difference. It's the y difference 35 minus 23, the difference of the two y-coordinates, over the x-difference, 17 minus 11. You need to watch out that you don't swap the order around. If you've started with this point A for the x, the y-difference, then you must start with the point A for the x-difference. Don't swap them around. Um, so 35 minus 23 is 12. And 17 minus 11 is 6. 6 and 12 goes 2 times. So the gradient is 2. And it certainly looks like a gradient of 2. 1 along, 2 up. So we've found M. We've found the gradient is 2. Point on the line. We can choose either of these two. Let, let's choose the one with the smaller numbers. 11 23. So the equation of the line of best fit is, then we use this formula here. So it's y minus the y-coordinate, that's b, which is 23, equals the gradient m, which is 2, times x minus a. x-coordinate is 11. A little bit of tidying up here y minus 23, 2x minus 22. We have to double both the x and the minus 11. And then let's add 23 to both sides to get rid of this minus 23. So that disappears. 2x is unchanged. Add 23 to minus 22 and we'll get 1. So the formula for this line is y equals 2x plus 1. So let's now look at the second part of this question. Now that we know why the sports score can be... This is the sports score. Can be got from the film score. That's the film score by doubling it and adding 1. Uh, use this equation, which is this one, uh, to estimate the sports score for a team with a film score of 8. So, film score 8, x equals 8. And let's try and work out the sports score then, using the equation. It says you double the film score, which is 8, so 2 times 8, and then add 1. So that's 17. 
and that's the sports score. So estimate the sports score. Sports score estimate is 17.